Bojo, Mishkikin, a gammon and a quinidish in a cause. Go cook on either them, Calgary and Jinjiba, a dish can see me go on in a da, Anishnabekwe and Dow, Irish and Scottish. Uh, just saying greetings in the Ojibwe language that my spirit name is Medicine Songwoman. I'm Awa Clan. And I said that I'm living in London, Ontario, and grateful to be here. Uh, and was born in, in Calgary. Uh, so take a deep breath into your belly and your heart. Flow it through you. And just keep doing that. And I'll bring through a song. And whatever else shows up. Uh, my screen, my technology is acting all funky. So uh, I don't know what it's going to look like. But uh, and hopefully the sound will be OK as well. But there's been some some things going on. Um, so just uh, breathe into your your whole being and and uh, yeah, and allow yourself to receive, release, and flow whatever is yours to receive, release, and flow. Just breathing into your heart and into your belly.
breathing into your whole being and feeling yourself grounded, feeling yourself connected to gravity that holds you to earth, to mother earth 24 seven, always, always gravity keeps us grounded, keeps us here. We just have to tap into it and remember it's here for us, connecting us to mother earth, connecting us to each other with that magnetic presence that we also are. So um, the message that was coming through while I was singing is oh, just slow down and be here for what's coming and for what's here. Most importantly, for what's here now. And every moment after for what's here now, for what's here now, for what's here now, as things shift and change, and that's going to happen rapid, fast, someone is telling me rapid, fast is the words they use. Um, and someone else says like lightning. So we are going to have some changes happening across the globe that uh, that will be happening fast. And I am not going to comment too much on that. Uh, I don't interpret when I hear from spirit like that. Uh, I know it's global, so I don't really feel that it is to do with any particular election or anything like that. It's just to do with it, it, the, the energy in the air, the energy that we have that's here, that's available to us, but also, you know, mass consciousness and the things that are happening just globally. Um, to do with Mother Earth and her changes, to do with this whole situation that we're in. Uh, so it's kind of like buckle up and get ready and uh, and just be here, be here for it. And, you know, when, when you see a storm, it's not like you run headlong into it. So just sit and be present in yourself and be like that tree that can, that, that old growth tree that can just stand up to anything grounded fully to the earth flowing energy up from the earth down to the earth and that's what we as humans have the capability to do we just uh, forget that so imagine you're doing just like that tree just like a, an old growth forest tree standing tall allowing its branches to bend and sway even the trunk just bends and sways just a little bit because there's enough flexibility there enough flexibility and still weathering the storm and that's what we all need to do right now is is kind of just weather the storm and you know we're going to see that rainbow at the other end of it as well so uh and many many of, of those i'm being told it's like there's lots going on and there has been for you know we've been in this a while um Really, we've been in this, when you think about it, we've been in this about it's 16, 17 months or something like that. But a global picture, bigger picture, we're talking, this, this is just, this is another phase that Mother Earth is going through with, uh, you know, the, we happen to be alive in this one. And uh, so we're, we're kind of planting seeds right now for the, the next seven generations. And we need to remember and honor that and just... Like, what can we do on an individual level, on a collective level, on a community, family level? What can we do? What can we do to make things better? What can we do to help this change be easier for those who might have it a lot harder than we do? So just breathe here. Know that you are supported. You are loved. You are even blessed, even if it feels like you're not. You are and you know and we're all having our own human experiences but we are we are riding this out on the same mothership here you know we're all on planet mother earth here so we can all have different experiences different thoughts and different ways of being and knowing and doing but we all kind of come across each other in this in this woven path and so what we all need to keep in mind is to just be kind to ourselves and to each other. That's the message for today. So just breathing into your belly again. And if you have your eyes closed, taking your sweet time to open them. And uh, um, because of the, <clears throat> if anyone was watching, a lot of times you'll notice my hands are moving around quite a bit. 
um, because I know that my um, green screen and all these other technical wonderful things are not working the way they normally do. Uh, I'm just uh, trying to keep my hands where, where they won't turn into weird little things. <laughs> so just breathing in here and grounding yourself, like feeling, feeling your feet on the floor, on the ground, you know, feeling that connection that we all have to Mother Earth, um, that that energy really does flow up and down, up and down through us all the time, it does. And when we tap into that and when we really um, become present, it, it just becomes even better. Um, and more helpful for us and for all our relations. So, so yeah. Um, again, I'm Brenda McIntyre. Medicine Songwoman is my Indigenous name. Uh, and this series is my gift to you uh, of a few minutes of stress relief, self-care, uh, connection to self, connection to spirit, connection to earth, and connection to moon. Um, being reminded the reason that I do this in these concerts, or rather these uh, moments in the first place is is uh um is that full moon and, and grandmother moon just you know whatever wherever we are in that cycle um and while i do these moments every monday every full moon i also uh the closest wednesday to that full moon i do a medicine song healing concert and actually you know you're invited and this month is free so feel free to join us uh the link is in my bio or in the post description depending on what platform you're you're seeing this on uh, and yeah, please uh, give me a heart or a heart thumbs up. Uh, uh, thanks uh, for sharing and um, and please let me know how this was for you. Yeah, so Chimi uh thank you for watching and uh, please feel sh feel free to share the love. Get us all again. I love you and love and blessings. Bama um, P, which is see you later in Ojibwe. <laughs>